So you're looking for a vehicle in the Philippines and if you're like me, you've seen that many vehicles you just get sick of going to look at them because on the pictures they look great but when you get there in real life, the engine's blowing smoke Filipinas, the majority, and it's the truth, don't tend to look after the vehicles you know, they might change the oil every now and then, but that's about it they run them into the ground, same with the motorbikes when there's three or four people on a motorbike but every now and then if you're really lucky and you're a foreigner in the Philippines you can go to another foreigner and buy a really good quality vehicle that you know the guy who's selling it is not going to steer you wrong and this is it now I've left the engine going now look at the exhaust clean metal it's had a major service just recently uh, by the Suzuki dealer oh, I didn't mean to leave that in <laughs> there's two belts out of change, one's the air condition, the other's the fan belt they didn't need changing but I asked them to change it so I knew they were changed the car's got all these covers on to uh, keep the seats clean all the upholstery, everything's excellent condition the car, the whole car is like new it's in excellent condition everything works, there's no major or minor issues with it the tyres are like brand new it'll seat 8 people include the driver include the driver, well 9, 10 it'll push as long as they're not big people um, it's got the tint the only thing you're going to have to do if you want to but it's entirely up to you, it's cosmetic is the tint I want redoing that's what I would have done with it it's the top of the range Suzuki as you can see there's no dints, bumps there's the odd minor scratch but you're going to get that on most cars anyway but as you can see it's in beautiful condition the brakes are perfect, the gearbox is perfect you can't, well you can't hear the engine going can you and uh, you put it into gear, you can't feel it there's no clunks, bumps, bangs, nothing so it's just a mint vehicle let you hear. Can you hear the engine? Don't think you can, can you? Probably now. So, if we put it, put it into gear, look, that's reverse. You can't hear it, you can't feel it go into gear. And that's how an automatic box should be. Everything works, there's nothing that doesn't work. The CD player, everything. It has a camera here, look, and it has a rear camera as well. So when you put it into re when you put it into reverse, the you can see out the back. I'll just show you the bonnet. The engine's actually under the seat, not under the bonnet. But just show you how clean the car is it's in beautiful condition and that's no exaggeration so you can see it's like new there is absolutely no issues with it now to get a car like this you'd be paying a lot more than I'm asking for it this uh, FM radio bolts right? yeah I'm forced to sell it I haven't got a choice um, I'm not going to tell you why <laughs> because it's nobody's business but ours but I'm having to sell it um, now I'm going to um, suspend the ability to make comments on this video to, uh, so I haven't got to start blocking a load of trolls and different people that's asking personal questions it's the top of the range Suzuki APV it's a 1.6 petrol but it pulls like anything it's excellent on fuel um, when it's full it's it's brilliant 
there's no squeaks knocks rattles it's like a brand new vehicle it's incredibly low mileage let's have a look what are you doing over there babe it's incredibly low mileage and like I say everything works there's the mileage look and uh, don't forget it's in kilometers not uh, not miles um, it's just beautiful inside smells nice the carpets are fresh there's no damage to the carpets the seats no damage to nothing the aircon's really cold uh, trying to think what else to say I don't know what else to say Mel oh Mel wants me to switch the radio on oh that's it isn't it there you go it's not working Mel there you go so it's got a CD and it's also got a cassette player don't ask me why it's got a cassette player but uh, it has so that's it that's our car um, now if you're interested and only if you're interested and that's if you're going to send me a message saying you want to come and see it then please go to my email which is in the description below and uh, send me a message via my email but I must warn you that I'm not going to reply to people I know is just fishing for information and aren't really interested in the car so you'll get one shot at it and then I won't answer again I know that sounds pretty mean but I've had such a lot of messing about and it's basically um, from Filipinos because I've tried to sell it here and they're wanting it for nothing and uh, it's not going to happen I, I can't sell it for less than what I've got it advertised for if I wasn't in such a rush to sell it it would be 400,000 minimum because the, the car is like new it, it drives like new it's got no issues the steering the gearbox the engine is absolutely solid um, I don't know what more I can say can you think of anything babe there's an extra wheel right underneath oh yeah there's a spare wheel underneath like I say all the wheels are like practically new tread on them um, it's it's just in amazing condition really lovely condition so if you want a good vehicle and you want to buy it off somebody that's honest and is going to tell you the truth um, like I say the only thing that you you might want to do but it's up to you is replace the tint that's what I would have done at some point because the tint's been on for quite a while and it needs redoing basically but that's about it so that's it into babe yes. that's it so if you want to get in touch then contact me on my email and don't miss this car because I don't care where you are in the Philippines you won't get a car in this kind of condition with the low mileage so I'm looking for 350,000 or very nearest offer so if you want a really good motor and you know you're going to get a good motor and you're not going to come and say oh my god you didn't tell me about this or oh you didn't tell me about that then come and have a look at this motor because it's absolutely a lovely vehicle and we've got it that we've got to sell it but unfortunately we have to sell it you are baby it is a lovely car and we need it but we have to sell it yeah we'll not get something like this again will we and honestly guys you won't get something like this um, it's very rare you'll find a, the, the the guy who owned it was a Canadian and he owned it he's owned it practically from new and they've only used it when he's come to the Philippines because they, they'd come for about three four months and then they go back to Canada him and his wife they're from Legadsby it was actually bought in Naga from uh, Naga Suzuki wasn't it yeah. so I took it back there and it, it had its major service the major service is all the the aircon belt the fan belt 
it's had oil change, filter change, air filter change, it's had gearbox oil changed, uh, it's had all the brakes serviced. I asked them to skim the front discs and put new brake pads on because there was a little a uh, bit of a neck around the discs at the front. It was only tiny, but I got them to skim it and put brand new uh, Bosch brake pads on the front. They didn't need replacing, but I wanted to replace them because obviously it's done no mileage. So the back ones are perfect. So it's all cleaned up. Everything that wanted adjusting and what have you was adjusted. Um, that's about it. So email me tell me if you're interested and uh, get yourself a good vehicle you're still handing me the camera just switch the aircon off i know it's getting a bit dark we've left it really late to do it but the car it's just so smooth and quiet and responsive it's only relaxing yeah, well, I'll give you an example. Every time we go on a bus or a, a jeepney or whatever it is, van also van. Van, Mel's throwing up. <laughs> We've been to Legadsby in this and all over the place, and Mel is fine. She doesn't throw up. Yeah, it, it's that smooth. It's smooth, yeah. Not like the other. It's very moving. <laughs> So like I say, apologies it's a bit dark, but it's a little bit of extra video. <laughs> Tell you what, driving in the Philippines is just crazy. <laughs> exactly. You need to be careful when you're driving. Especially the kids on the road. Well, they come up the side of you, they come on the outside yeah. of you, they cross over the front of you like this guy's just done. They cut you up, they do all kinds of crazy things. It's not their right of way, but they'll still come towards you and they can see there's nowhere to get through, but they'll still come, block the road off, and it's you that has to move. incredible as well is the put really dark tint on the windows and that's fine during the day when it's hot and sunny but at night they can't see nothing through it it just uh, obstructs the vision um, it's got a little bit of a tint on the front and I, I was just gonna pull that off because it's just too dangerous But of course, it's entirely up to you whether you retint it. But if if I did retint it, I was going to have the bare minimum tint on it. I wasn't going to have the tint it has on now. It's just too much. Lions roaring in the morning sun Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We 
must never stop the way. Birds chirping and I hear my name. Grasping into a life. Life is happy but it's so insane. We must merely make a strive. Savannah.